You know something? I didn't actually think I talked to this toad earlier, so let's talk to him. Yeah, welcome to the hidden Titanal Castle, the Forest of Fear. Hmm. Wait, your castle? Excuse me? Are you this Titania that everybody keeps glossing about? Titanium stars, right. Uh, well, they do have paintings, so I guess that constitutes somewhat as a museum. Anyway, yeah, we're back in Star Revenge 6.25. Really liked to... Oh, there we go. Really liked to know where the lives counter is. Cannon and first overworld. Whatever. We're going back to course two because there's shit that needs to get there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you still have your happy sand all music. So I feel like I should be coin collecting. I'm good at this game. <laughs> I feel like I should be coin collecting at some point because this does have an 80 coin star, so whatever. Let's kill the Frank Gumbas. Uh, so, I would have gotten this segment up earlier, but I noticed that Big Dip posted a video of the Mushroom Cup, which is his new Mario Land LP. I don't know if it was a patron exclusive or... It probably was, I just wasn't reading the title closely enough, but, yeah, it's there. It was rather enjoyable. I got to watch him bounce off a house for, like, five to ten minutes tr trying to get a star, and all he received is a one-up. Probably won't uh, contain as much fail as um, uh, this segment will, but kill the stupid poke. And... I'm not feeling brave enough to go in there. I'm just coin collecting at the moment because I don't know what else to do with my life. Mm -hmm. Apparently there's supposed to be a hidden cave in this level. I'm not sure where exactly it would be. How did you do that? And I jumped over the poke ankle. Die, please. Give me your money. Give me your lunch money because I need it. Okay. Okay. Frank was part of the anti-bullying campaign. The anti pokey bullying campaign. Yes. Didn't you know? Pokies have been abused for a long time. By ones such as myself. Right, I'm just hoping I don't dive off the level because that would send me to the lower parts and that would end in point sadness. Okay, so I... No. I read these signs closely, and apparently they're supposed to appear here, but they aren't actually here. Maybe I should have... I'm, I'm just going to try and triple, triple jump dive here. And hopefully not press C this next time. There we go. Oh, wait, this just leads to the cave. It does, however, lead me to a blue coin switch that is right here. So let's get that. And screw it up. Ah, I'm sure there's more coins in here somewhere. I don't need all of them. And if not, eh, this will be a waste of time, but I can always just re enter the level and get some more coins. Yeah, there's plenty of coins down here. So let's get them. So yeah, this is a, basically the second level from Star Revenge 6 and 6.5. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming that the Secret Cave music is angry Aztec, because it was for the previous two versions of Star Revenge 6. They aren't too bad, I mean, it's not... They aren't exactly the best when done on the Mario sound font, Mario 64 sound font. But they're okay. Oh, we got hidden numbers. I think I got a hidden number the last playthrough, and it's like I didn't notice that it was a... Wait, what? 
Is this where I came in? I think it was where I came in. Oh well. Okay. Oh, it's, it's just a fly guy. Okay. I'm not sure where I'm going to... Oh, shit. I'd like those coins, please. Thank you. Alright. Whatever. There was a slight purpose to that. So, I should be grateful. And there is a fly guy over here. Kill this asshole. Good. Get me coins. Uh, no need to hit the switch, I think. Because I'm not going after that exact same star if I don't fall off every freaking surface. Uh, I have the microphone up really close to my face because I tend to mumble a lot and then it doesn't really picked up well by the microphone. So. If I scream or something, like if I fall off a ledge for no discernible reason. Oh, there's a poke. Gimme. <sighs> Gimme your lunch money now. Okay, stop falling off of surfaces. Uh, actually, yeah, that just leads to a star. Why did I even come up here? Yay, falling off of... Oh, hey, there's another yellow transparent box there that I can't do anything about, so... Alright, I need to find the uh, final eight coins. And I swear to God, if I needed those um, uh, two blue coins from the blue coin switch, I'm not going to be happy. Alright, uh, looking for coins. I'm sure there's plenty over here. There's a flame shooter. Uh, still not going to enter the cavern because I don't know if that actually leads to a different part of the course that resets all my coins, so... Okay. Alright. Did I just loop around the entire course? I hear an app. What is this? Is this number five? Yeah, that's number five. Ah. I don't know what's going on. Watch me as I wander aimlessly. Yeah, this is where the blue coin switch was. And this camera is a, a work of art. It belongs in a museum. Kind of like the museum that I just was in. If you can call it that. Oh, there's another. Please. And I can probably long jump from here if I can get up the freaking edge. And... Yeah, more hidden numbers. I think I'll go for the hidden numbers then, because... Still hear an app. I don't know why I'm hearing it. So, three more coins from hidden numbers, presumably, and I should probably go up here. Did I really just wall jump? Come on. We're like eight and a half minutes in, and I've yet to get a single star. Hello. And it probably peaked harshly there. Did I go down this way already? Yes, I did, because I remember that front block. God damn it, I have no idea where I'm going. Uh. Uh. Oh, god damn it. I probably needed those freaking blue coins, didn't I? No. Stop that. Why do you two? Let me get off across here, please. Please tell me there's coins around here. Please. Yes, there's a pokey. Oh my god. Now I only need two more coins. Uh, I mean, I could get them from hidden numbers, but I don't know where they are, so... Ugh. Or I could just get them from there, and I'll probably just sink into the tar here. It's not immediately quicksand. There we go. <sighs> now let's save. Oh my god, I actually got a star. After nine and a half minutes. Cool. Alright. Do these flip. Yeah. 
Okay, so these are... I guess this kind of reminds me of Super Mario Galaxy. Alright. After complaining about not getting stars for nine and a half minutes, I got two in a row within one. Yay. Alright, so that was the fourth star, I presume. Alright. So let's get some more, if I can. Needs to find the rest of the hidden numbers. And this led to Sucker and Sucker Dash. Alright. I'm gonna hit the switch for no reason, because that mattered so much. And. God damn it, there was just another Pokey here. I'm gonna kill you because I'm irritated with you. Just for the Carthosis factor, I suppose. Yeah, I'm, I'm mostly just wandering at this point. But, uh... I'd like to get a good vantage point so I can f figure out where things are. Maybe if I jump across to the boxes again. Okay, so maybe if I look from here, I can f figure out where things are. I don't know, because there's not the greatest draw distance from things. Are there any stars? Hmm. I think I'm gonna go find that cave again that I am uh, past before and figure out where that is. We long jumping is so much fun. No, I already collected that star if I'm remembering right. Yeah, shell surfing in the cave. I'm pretty. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the cave star. Shell surfing in the cave, is that the similar to the star other star that was in Star of the original Star Revenge 6? Because I remember you had to do that, and there were a bunch of amps making your life miserable. Well, this is the way to number two, so. Wait. Yeah, that leads to the cave, isn't it? And it would be really nice if the camera would listen to me. No coins. None whatsoever. Alright. And change of music. Oh, there we go. There's Angry Aztec. Shell surfing the cave. I gotta say, this is a much better uh, MIDI than the other two. So what do I need here? Camera, please. Uh, but why though? Okay. Uh, uh, I assume this tar kills you. I have no idea what I'm doing, so... Yeah, there's an amp. We're running in the 90s. There we go, that wasn't too difficult at all, now was it? <sighs> okay, cool. Now how do I get back? Or did, did you think that far ahead? We... Cool. Got the ledge there, thinking I wasn't going to get damaged, and though there was the flame shooter to give you damage anyway. It's fine. There were some coins. Alright. So where does this take me? Nowhere, because there's a grate over it. That wasn't too bad. Sunshine platforms over the tire. Okay. So we 
Can I wall jump off of the cactus? I don't think I can. No, because that ended in colossal kumquats, and I don't know. Alright, what direction do I go in now? Over here? Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I, I assumed those flipped. Oh, they flipped alright, they flipped me off. And we're forgetting to dive, apparently. Alright. It's no big, no huge issue to get back up here. Yep, just ground pound in there and sink and probably die. Still refusing to save state. I'm sure that the later levels will have some fantastic um, uh, bullshittery in them, forcing me to have a save state. Okay. Hmm, okay. You know, this would be more annoying if... Okay, no, it's pretty goddamn annoying. But I can get back up there quickly, so it's fine. Unless we get stuck underneath the note block, or miss it. Okay. What a fracas this is. Okay, just do a little flippy thing. And completely miss it. I have not managed to get back onto that central platform yet. I'm sure Josh will say something about the stupid failure, jump failures, because that's all he comments on. Except for Sandopolis Zone. Okay. Alright. Can I make it? Yes, I can. Oh, wow. Holy crap. I swear to God, if that amp. Alright. I'm competent at this game, I swear. I swear to God, if I would have missed that. And there we go. And that makes 14. Hmm, let me see. Shiny Stare of the Dead. And... Shiny Stare of the Dead. What is that supposed to mean? Is that the hidden numbers? Because I've already collected two of them, and though I have us less than uh, two minutes before the... I hit the 20 minute mark. Yep, sure. Come on, 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 come on. Okay, that's another hidden number down. So, yeah, I think this can afford to go on a little longer than 20 minutes if I mess up. I'd like to know where the other hidden numbers are. I mean, that's, I guess that's the point, is you're just supposed to randomly guess where the coins are. Oh, I think I know why it's called Shiny Stare of the Dead, though, because these skulls are, um, uh, they're skulls in this tar, and I guess they have eyes. I'm just supposed to find all the skulls. So. And I'm guessing there are some on the other side of the tar pit as well, so let's go over there and check. And it would be really nice if the camera could look up for me for a second. But since when has the camera ever want given a shit whenever I want it, right? Let's see. Now I've just landed right in the tar. No, can't kick up slope. Okay, I'm gonna have to get up onto that some other way. Like that. Hmm. Alright, we're just past the... Almost past the 20 minute mark, but it's fine. It won't matter if I get this quick enough. Fuck. 
Unless I don't. Is that the last one there? No. Turn around, dingus. That was the best triple jump I could have possibly made. Um, I think I'm lost. All right. I just almost stood, suddenly start going up that. I have no idea. No. God damn it. I'm just, this level still confuses me. I have to find my way around so many odd freaking surfaces. Oh, and then the camera changes like that and it just screws me up. I can't see the goddamn skull. doesn't have it. Yeah, this level is really confusing. I'm sorry. It is very... Pinocchio nose. I don't even know what hell... I don't even know if that's a reference, but I'm saying it anyway. I've already checked those. I have no idea where I'm going. Alright, let's check the other screen side of the course again. That one is already checked. You can probably hear me tapping on my freaking controller. I do have a new uh, Xbox controller keyboard that. Xbox 360 controller that. Ouch. That doesn't tilt to the left, so. Alright, for that, I suppose. Oh, there it is! Now, if I could get onto it, that would be a joy. There we go. Alright. It only took 22 and a half minutes. Now I have to find the star. Which would be very nice. There it is. Alright. So that's... Yeah, so that's Tarpit Canyon, and there, again, there are two stars that I can't get, so... When we get back, we'll do the... Well, I guess we'll explore the castle a little more, and... Maybe get into the third level. I, I don't know. You'll find out. So, in the meantime, peace.